This is Primary School Made Easy and in this video we're looking at fractions making one part two. We have one half, one part out of two. There it comes. One half. How many more halves do we need to make one? One half plus what? equals 1. Let's see. One more half. So one half plus one half equals 1. We have three quarters, three parts out of four. One quarter two quarters, three quarters. How many more quarters do we need to make one? Three quarters and how many quarters equals one? Let's complete the circle. It's one more quarter. So three quarters plus one quarter equals one. This time we've got four sixths, four parts out of six. One sixth, two sixths, three sixths, and four sixths. How many more sixths do we need to make one? Four sixths and how many equals one? Let's see. One sixth and two sixths. So four sixths plus two sixths equals one. Let's have a look at the pattern. Nine ninths equals one, four quarters is one, twenty-five twenty-fifths is one, two halves is one, seven sevenths equals one, ten tenths equals one, six sixths equals one, three thirds equals one, eight eighths equals one, a hundred a hundredths equals one, five fifths equals one, and twelve twelfths equals one. They all equal one. This time we've got one. The whole, two parts out of two. One half, two halves. If we take away one half, what will be left? Two halves take away one half is how many? Let's take half away. And we can see we've got one half left. And which is the same as writing one take away one half equals one half. This time our whole is made up of four parts. One quarter, two quarters, three quarters and four quarters. If we take one quarter away, what will be left? Four quarters, take away one quarter, is how many? Let's take one quarter away. And we can see we've got three quarters left, which is the same as saying one take away one quarter equals three quarters.
This time our one has been chopped into six equal pieces. And there we have the whole. Six sixths. If we take away four sixths, what will be left? Six sixths take away four sixths is how many sixths? We take one away. We've got five sixths left. We take another one away, we've got four sixths left, we take our third one away, we've got three sixths left, and if we take the fourth one away, we've now got two sixths left, which is the same as one take away four sixths equals two sixths. Let's look at a problem with 10. So this time we've got one chopped into 10 equal pieces. If we take away 7 tenths, what will be left? One take away 7 tenths equals how many tenths? So we're starting with 10 and we take 7 away. 1, leaves us with 9, take away 2, leaves us with 8, take away 3, leaves us with 7, take away 4, leaves us with 6, take away 5, leaves us with 5, take away 6, leaves us with four and take away seven leaves us with three. So one take away seven tenths equals three tenths which is the same as saying ten tenths take away seven tenths is three tenths. That's great, well done, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.